Okay, hello once again. Greetings from Japan. And uh, it's a little bit of wind, so there might be some uh, wind noise on the on this video. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm just going to hopefully catch catch the uh, sun behind the clouds. So I'm going to move along. Anyway, this is a 2012 April. It's an ATH20, so it's the hybrid Alphard. It has 38,000 miles, uh, 62,000 kilometers, and it's in uh, this nice kind of dark gray blue color, quite unusual color in this car. It has the standard alloys, um, and it's the top of the range with uh, some roofs, full black leather, etc. Anyway, let's take a look at it. It's got the uh, usual HID AFS lights and front fog lights. You can see standard wheels. Presently it has winter tyres on it. Anyway, I presume it will be landing in the UK come winter. In Japan, uh, it's very common to uh, use two sets of tyres, uh, summer tyres and winter tyres. Even in Chiba here, where we don't get hardly any snow. Okay, so nice clean panels. This comes with, of course, two smart keys, and it has a remote rear gate. These are hybrid Alphards. Car fires are all four wheel drive, of course. Okay, you can see full black leather, twin sunroofs, and rear entertainment with premium sound. Okay, and there's another button up here for closing the rear door. And of course, it has all round parking sensors. Maybe I forgot to mention is, of course, it's hybrid. It's a, it's a 2.4 litre petrol engine with a hybrid system. Okay, 2012 April. Okay, again, nice clean, straight body panels. Particularly nice color, and uh, moving over here, we'll open the uh, rear doors. The, uh, the rear seats have some power assist on it for the reclining, and also for the foot, uh, the lumbar support, or whatever. Yeah, what it's called. And got the rear entertainment, the sunroofs, and we have installed the, uh, the handles on these to allow the seats to move sideways, which then allows you to move the seats a lot further back. You can uh, see the various positions if you. Uh, Look at the uh, photographs in the Dropbox file. Also, plenty of photographs of the uh, chassis underneath. Oh no, it's not actually a chassis, but the, the underneath of the car. Full black leather. These seats are quite heavy. All right. Also has these footrests here as well. Flip down out of the back of the seats. Okay, close the doors. And of course it is uh, keyless entry and keyless start. So it's just a push start. It has uh, memory positions driver seats. So You've got one more than one uh, regular driver. 
got power assist in uh, uh, front seats. Nice clean driver mat. lights on you can see there the mileage 62,000 kilometers and uh, let's go and turn the fan down otherwise you get this horrendous noise okay so we'll just start it up okay so you can see all the warning lights are off except of course the Fuel light is uh, showing low. Okay, and you get the, uh, the display on the shows you exactly what's happening with the hybrid system. So right now the petrol engine has just kicked in to uh, charge the battery. Okay, if in the Dropbox file there's a whole uh, slew of um, images showing uh, the uh, uh, diagnostics checks on the battery and the engine. Everything is working fine. Okay, and this one has a very clean dash, no problems there. Auto dipping mirror up here, you've got controls for the sunroof and the power doors and the rear gate. And inside here, you've got your You've got your uh, manuals, and a convenient tray. So this model comes with uh, uh, controls for the power seat, for the passenger power seat too, which is convenient for the driver or the uh, rear passenger. Okay. And so EV button, echo button, heated front seats. Cup holders here. Positively a non smoker car. Let's take a look. Let's go. Rear camera with guidance. Okay. And it's got uh, Bluetooth controls, audio controls, and uh, cruise control. Nice clean steering wheel. Yeah, the interiors. Very nice. Uh, yeah, I think that's about it for the interior. Well, we've installed a rear illuminated rear fog switch. You'll need to have your MOT guy put in the actual fog light on the back. But we've installed a proper. It's not obviously it's not connected now, so it's not illuminating. This controls the auto auto uh, folding. Uh, door mirrors. This is some kind of air cleaning system. And yeah, that's about it, I believe, for the interior. Anything I can think of. Okay, let's take a look at the engine. So I think the sun is going to come out any second. Here we go. It's a hybrid system with the 2.4 petrol engine. And this one's only got 38,000 miles on it. We don't get too many with this kind of mileage. They tend to be too expensive. So, here we go. And here's the auction sheet. It's uh, from Toyota Auction, actually Toyota dealer. It's a grade four. They only gave it CC. Um, yeah, not sure why, but as I've said so many times, um, Toyota grade their own cars rather severely. There is an A3 here. There is a very light scratch on that wing. There is a photograph of it. Uh, in the Dropbox file, you can see it's small and light. Besides that, the car is uh, clean.
and you can see here it's um it's a 24 so it's 12 uh, 2012 April 62,000 kilometers that's 38,000 miles color is uh, stated as Murasaki which is purple more of a bluey gray um, yeah and that's it anyway it's the top of the range one with all the leather and roofs and everything and, yeah and of course it has auto wipers auto lights um, yeah so if you're looking for uh, an economical uh, people carrier uh, the hybrids are the best as you know uh, Toyota has been manufacturing hybrids since 1997 so that's 26 years so they're um, way ahead on any of the other manufacturers when it comes to hybrid. If this car is of interest to you, please do talk to Paul at Japan Auto Agents and uh, he can guide you through the process of uh, purchasing the car and we can uh, get it to you as fast as we can. Right now we're shipping in containers and container boats are leaving every week. So that's working quite well. Anyway, thanks for watching and bye for now. We are a UK-based personal car import agent trading since 2004. We have a proven track record supplying thousands of Japanese cars direct from Japan to customers throughout the UK. Working as your appointed agent for a fixed commission, we provide a four-step personal car import service. This is an opportunity to cherry pick and safely buy the best high grade, low mileage cars direct from Japanese car auctions at export trade prices for personal import to the UK. You will make large savings on UK retail prices while buying the best quality cars available in Japan. It's a genuine win-win opportunity. Before the auction starts, background checks and hands-on inspection are carried out by the Japanese staff. Under Japanese law, any accident history or mileage discrepancy must be declared by the auction and shown on the auction report. The truth is the best cars normally stay in Japan. They are bought by Japanese dealers for resale because the best cars will pass a strict Japanese roadworthy test, known as a shaken. Shaken failures are seen in Japan as fit for recycle or export. Many turn up in the UK without the auction port to maximize the dealer's profit margins. So it's vital to see a genuine translation of the auction report before the sale starts. Once we have found a particular car, we next arrange our hands-on inspection to confirm the condition matches the auction report and take a large number of photos. Keep in mind we are not car dealers buying and selling for profit. Why supply bad cars? when it's just as easy to supply a great car from the fountain of supply and simply keep adding to our long-established superb track record. Check out our customer reviews or head to our YouTube channel found on our website to see the quality of the cars we supply. To learn more, pick up the phone and speak to us direct without obligation. Ask for Paul. Telephone 01625 560 or on mobile 07989 560 our email sales at japautoagent.com